And uh, we are going live in five, four, three, two, and one. What is going on? My name is Ben, and welcome to another episode of my daily vlog where I try to inspire you to achieve your goals and therefore your dreams. How are you? Happy Thursday. Uh, today it's been a kind of a nice day in the morning and uh, then in the afternoon it got cloudy. We're supposed to get rain tomorrow here in Ulan, New Hampshire. And Saturday we may go someplace during the day. We will see how the weather looks like. And today I am doing double duty, meaning I am going to be doing two episodes of this show. I'm doing one right now and then I need to finish uh, the preparation for the next show which I already have uh, I really want to have I, I already have the topics I want to uh, the topic I want to talk about I just need to finish writing the uh, the key points that I typically write for each show and then I'm gonna I need to look for a quote but other than that time I'm, I'm ready to kind of go after the show so again after the show I'm going to go for a break for maybe 20 minutes or so uh, and then I'm going to go live again because I was out for five days and I missed five days uh, of doing this show and what I want to do is do double duty until I get back to on track with my goal which is doing 365 episodes this year 2019 so and today I'm going to talk to you about uh, we finished with chapter 8 of Master Plan Your Success, the book I wrote for my kids and for my friends, and hopefully for you if you ever get to read it. And if you don't have any money to buy it, watch the show because I am reading this book from beginning to end. And not every single day, but I will say most days I've been reading this on and on, on and off, on and off. So uh, yesterday we finished with chapter 8 and now we're starting with chapter 9. However, the beginning of chapter 9 is uh, a page and a half. So I'm going to divide that on two parts, so in two episodes. And uh, so I'm going to proceed with the following segment which is called don't buy yourself problems a friend of mine nicknamed dirt told me one time you bought yourself a problem in reference to a particular situation where i overlooked the negative consequences carried carried by involving myself romantically with a certain lady he used to frequently use that phrase on many different situations where either himself or a friend would act upon without thinking about the repercussions included but often hidden in their decisions. For example, a friend of us was complaining about, his, about this puppy he recently obtained, how he now have to walk him every morning around 4 a.m., clean his pee all over the house, deal with destroyed furniture, veterinary bills, barking in the middle of the night, all because the puppy was so cute. My friend Dirt would plainly tell our friend, you bought yourself a problem, man. So, uh... You know, when you, I like to think about the the things I am going to do. And again, this this happens sometimes. Even when you we think about the 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 negative consequences of the things we do, and I'm not recommending you not to do the things you you love, or I'm not saying do not follow your dreams. I'm just saying that it is a good thing to uh, not necessarily overthink because overthinking is often uh, unproductive so but it is uh, it is a good thing to think about the, the 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 consequences or the problems that can come with the things that you are about to do and uh, and again sometimes 
you know, getting involved with, let's say, somebody who just got out of jail. I'm just say, making an example uh, right now. You know, he or she may be very nice and everything, but you know, why is why was he or or she in jail? Because they got caught. They got caught stealing something my very very you know un minor yeah still a crime but if you're getting involved with that person you need to be aware of that of that situation or why was she or him inside in jail because they raped somebody you know i'm just giving you an extreme example well you're buying yourself a problem if you're dating that person so that's what i'm saying is evaluate what are you gonna do and uh, the quote that I have for you tonight reads, never buy problems for your own self. And that is it. Uh, that is all that I got for you for now. I uh, will be back in about half an hour with a second episode and a different topic. And if you like this video, please Give it a like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so. And if you want notifications, hit that bell and you will be getting a notification every time I go live or every time I upload a new video. And very important, if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below and I will do my best to answer them as soon as possible, typically the very next day. Again, I'll be back in about half an hour, 20 minutes or so with a second episode for today. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you later. Bye.